I'm uh, pleased to be part of this event honoring uh, Penny and Steve Weinberg, their family first, but perhaps more important uh, for this occasion is that they are very special people. And uh, I'm pleased they're getting this important recognition because they really care, they really try, they really give a lot of themselves, as well as their financial resources, they give a lot of themselves to improving the world, to helping people in ways that might be significant. They're, they're exemplars of the way Jews ought to be, and that's very, very meaningful to me personally, and it's, it's wonderful for our community to have people like that who are really on the front lines of organizations, of doing the right thing, of worship, of raising their families, of observing the uh, Jewish holidays. They really are models and examples of what a Jewish life can be. They're real Jews, and that's, that's very important, and that touches me. Jewish National Fund could never find anyone better to epitomize the love of Israel that JNF represents than Steve and Penny, who are passionate lovers of Israel. Steve and Penny have the capacity and the ability to make a lot of choices in life as to how to spend their time. I'm grateful that they've chosen to spend a good chunk of their time in making life better for others. Steve is an officer of the Federation in the past and our overall campaign chair. Penny, through her work on the board of the International Joint Distribution Committee, they're just terrific examples of how you can live a rich, meaningful life. I feel that they inspire other people to do good things. They're very dedicated, and whatever they do, they do well. By the same token, Tamar, we know a little bit about their neshama. If you all know out there in the audience what neshama means, looking into their soul. It isn't just writing checks. It isn't just philanthropy, although JNF is very close to their heart. They have a personality, which I think shines through with Steve's case, when he puts on his helmet and rides his motorcycle. He and a group of other cyclists, all Jews, who care about Judaism, about Israel, and they just have a ball. And so the real Steve comes out when he's roaring across the land and that wonderful motorcycle of his. And the real Penny comes out when she's boxing. Yeah. Or else looking for bargains at TJ Maxx, <laughs> which she loves to do. The gift of giving is a gift in and of itself. And when you want to help, and that's the motivation, it's even more special. They're not looking for recognition when they make a gift. They're looking to do good for the sole purpose of helping others. That is a unique quality. You know, if you look at it from the standpoint of healthcare, recently they um, established and endowed a master clinician in brain health here at University Hospitals. That gift will help our physician scientists really take a very close look at chronic neurological diseases that really impact people's lives. It's not that they're suffering from that kind of disease process, but they see the great benefit that providing those dollars so that we can improve patient outcomes, so that they can improve their quality of life, that's what's so special about Penny and Steve. Well, I would say that uh, there are, there are uh, many people that give money to these type of causes. Uh, not many people give time. And Steve and Penny have always given, in addition to money, they've given their time, they've devoted their energy, they approach it like they approach everything in life, and that's wholeheartedly. And we're proud of them. 
that we have, I mean, uh, about two people that are always involved. I mean, not only giving, again, their money, but their time. And I know Penny, I Penny has been, no, very, very active in a lot of committees and, and Steve, it, it really is amazing. So when, when we were told that they were uh, going to be honored by the JNF, it was really an honor for us to be on the committee. We're saying that now, but uh, it really is the truth. I mean, they are very, very deserving of this. It's about being real. It's about being kind, being genuine, and uh, having big hearts. Not doing things because they want recognition. Um, not doing things because they want awards, but doing things because they're the right thing to do. And um, doing things very, very quietly uh, to help out. And uh, it's real. It's, it's deep rooted and uh, perhaps most telling, it's passed on to the next generation. They have three wonderful daughters and son-in-laws um, and their level of leadership in the community is really testament to the values that they learn from their parents. So uh, let me take this opportunity, Penny and Steve, to say Mazel Tov, to say thank you, Toda Rabah. Uh, I'm really proud to be your uncle. Enjoy this uh, celebration of the two of you. It is greatly deserved. I hope and I pray and I know that there will be many, many more occasions for celebration in your honor. But in the meantime, you should continue to be the outstanding people that you are. And uh, every one of us who travels somewhere in your orbit feels uh, touched by you and by all of the things that are important to you. Steve and Penny, I'm really sorry I can't be with you. I'm off uh, overseas on a Federation trip. But if I were there, I would be watching very carefully to see just how much you blush when everyone says so many nice things about you. And of course, I guess it's okay to blush because you really deserve hearing them. Congratulations to both of you on this signal honor. Very well deserved. Steve and Penny, you earned this award tonight the hard way. Thank you for everything you've done. Mazel tov. Penny and Steve, thank you for all of your contributions and all that you do for so many. So many that you won't meet, but you will impact their lives. Mazel tov. Steve and Penny, Kol Hakavod, all the honor on what's truly a most well-deserved honor. Mazel tov. We could go on forever, but they are really, they're great friends. And I think that's the bottom line where Kenny and myself are here. They really are They've been best friends to both of us. And they're well-deserving of this award. Mwah.